Hello there, this is Nabs bringing you more SnowRunner. We're currently in uh, the Russian area. Uh, believe we're in the map, the Rift. We're going to be doing a mission in with the new, which is going to require four drop-offs of cement. So I got uh, brought over Dan, one of my favorite trucks to say, yay. And put a trailer on them also, so hopefully we should be able to do this in one drop. And then load up the trailer. I got three quarters tank of gas. So we should be good to go. Uh, let's map out my route. Gotta pick up my entry there. Cut across here. Snake through all this. I got a service trailer in the way. Oh, that's going to be fun. It's right in the road, too. Oh, well. That's where I left it. Alright, we got to get back around there without high centering on one of these tree stumps. That would be nice not to high center on the tree stump. Dan's a pretty good vehicle. I... I find it a good multi-use vehicle. Its biggest problem is it has that low sit in front. All right, we need winch out time. Come on, you can get out of this. Six wheels of spinning. We should be able to get out of here. We got good mud tires on it. Shouldn't be an issue. And we finally get through it. Funny, on the way here, I didn't have any problems. I also like this uh, Dan because of the overhang at the front. Reminds me of when I drove a bus. I drove a... Whoa! I drove a Gillix. Which have a... a they have a decent overhang on the front of the, on the, front of the bus. But it's... What makes it, I mean, besides the steering is a little weird because you're steering from a point behind you. Uh, the cantilever on the up and down motion. Man, talk about wanting to give you motion sickness all the time. The front end of the bus travels three times faster than the rest of the bus. You know, it's kind of like uh, you ever ride in the back of the bus, uh, the school bus. It's the same kind of feeling. You get that overexertion of up and down when the rest of the vehicle is not really doing that. Just you know, that cantilever right there. And then while trying to steer while doing it, and then you zoom around the corner faster than your wheels are. It's it's really a unique experience. I mean, it's not that unique. Those buses are everywhere. But, you know, it's, it's not like driving, you know, it, much of anything else. Those cantilevers like that are really kind of odd. Turn the way. Well, we're doing pretty good so far. Only get one slowdown up to this point. I still have a lot of tricky turns. There's a mission on the way. Tricky turns ahead of me. Um, not sure how many mud conditions. And I've got a trailer in the middle of the road. I'm going to have to figure out how to get around. Is this a mission I've unlocked or not? Not a good, it's not good for Dan. Big zap front end into the ground. Like a shovel. Oh, speed run. I don't want anything to do with that right now. We are not prepared for that right now. We want to get this mission complete and then uh, work on another one. But we're getting there. Cruising along pretty good now. Dan's doing a good job. Yay! I picked the right vehicle, maybe. It's not over yet. Over some of my last couple of uh, missions. I'm hoping for a good result today. I'd slowed down playing on uh, SnowRunner for a little bit. Because, uh... Got real frustrated with one mission that just I couldn't I couldn't get a grip on it. It just kept having problems. Kept losing cargo. 
Thought I'd have the right vehicle and it wouldn't work out. Alright, this looks like there's enough room. I should be able to get by on this grass section. It's just can I swing the trailer around in there? Oh yeah, plenty of room. Oh, alright, I lied. Not plenty of room. Ow. Dan got hurt. Alright, so we got a lot of water here. Where's the first drop at? First drops... Oh, I should have gone straight. I should have not have turned the wheel. Um, let's see here. Oh, I totally befo... Befuddled that one. Um, can I get it back there? No, I'm not going to be able to get it back there. I'm not going to be able to control the trailer. Um, let's see. Let's go get this one. Then we'll get that one, and then we'll drop off the tra we'll drop the trailer, and then do the others. That's the plan for the moment. Hopefully, it works. Oh, that's not deep at all. I mean, he's having a little trouble with it, but it's not that deep. It looked deeper than what? Oh, wait, now we're having trouble. Trying to get the concrete trailer through here. Oh, this isn't going to work. It's not going to do what I want it to do. It's going to take it off. Can I get it to take it off the trailer? I'm betting it takes it off the truck. It did! That's not what I wanted you to do. Can I move the car here? Nope. Won't let me shift it. Alright. Well, uh, this is going to be bad news. Now I'm going to have to do all this driving around with this trailer on it, even when my truck's not going to like this. Uh, no, 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 no. I already know I can't go that way. I gotta go out this way. Oh! I should have disconnected the trailer first. I know it was going to be this much of a pain in the butt. Alright, well, fine. We're gonna go forward, I guess. It's not gonna let me go forward. Is it already touching the tree? It sure is. Go that way. Alright, I am officially stuck. I cannot get out of here. I don't know how to figure this out. This, this is a trap! It's a trap! I am trapped. I don't think disconnecting this trailer is going to do any good either. Yeah, see, I'm not even steering. I'm, I'm not turning. It's not turn letting the vehicle turn at all. Let's try a winch action here. Just winch it. Come on. It's not even moving a little bit. What the heck is it stuck on? There's a stump there. God dang it. There's no hope for this. This is a trap. This is nothing more than a trap. You can't... The only way out is the way of the trailer. Alright, we got this truck here. We're going to try to drag that trailer out and then see if we can't pull Dan out with the truck as well. This is a trap. It was definitely a trap. It, it was a trap and I drove right into it. It sure was. Now hopefully this truck can get there because... This isn't the 
the greatest mud water vehicle in the world. It's not bad though. I'll, I'll admit it. It uh, it surprises me quite a bit that how well it does. But at times there are little things that just befuddle it that I'm always shocked by. But to be honest, that's a lot of these vehicles where. I, You get a false sense of security. Yes, this truck does everything. And then all of a sudden, oh, no, it don't do that very well at all. And it happens to the best of us. All right, let's see if I can get up there and get... Oh, really, that's deeper than it looked. The day in this was nothing but a... Uh, wow, Danny had no trouble through here. This guy's uh, not doing well at all. be a mistake. Well, I don't really have much of a choice in this matter. Alright. I think that's good enough. Alright. No attachment. Sorry, wrong button. Alright, let's get this bad boy out of here. Sorry about that weird cut. Phone call! Have to take the word phone calls. Come on. Really? Alright, well that's as far as uh, he's going to be able to get him out. Let's see if I can't go in and pull Dan out. I'm not too optimistic with it. That's as far as I got the trailer. <laughs> I don't think this is in this truck's wheelhouse. But really, we're here for a guide for Dan. So let's see if we can't get it to... Uh... There we go. Starting engine. Oh, wrong way. Oh. That helps. Alright, Dan. Come on out of there. Alright, Dan is out. Now let's see if I can't get this truck back out of here. Get it out of the way. All right, I think that's uh, that's good enough. Yes, I can change trucks. Well, let's go get rid of this one, and we'll see how we do the rest. I'm not sure how I'm going to do it yet. But I'm pretty sure it's going to be a two truck, everything's going to be a two truck job at the rate that the... Uh, if anything's like the last... Oh man, they put wood planks in the way. Who would put the delivery right where you can't get to it? All right, that takes care of two. We've got two more left to do, and they're on the trailer. All right, we need to get the trailer out of there. <coughs> Whoa, that's good. It's right in the hole that the other truck made. And either Dan's just this much more powerful or Dan has some seriously tall wheels. Because it's doing this a lot better than the other truck did. And I don't even have it in its low reverse yet. Which I'm going to do now. That looks like as far as low reverse is going to get me. 
we go. Hold it right there. Can I still reach it? Oh, yes. Good. All right, that didn't work. Just kind of pull it. Use the winch. Get it out into the water. All right, that's good enough. Away we go. Ah, oh, too much playing around in this uh, mud section. I think I've created a giant hole. It's okay. Now, we're not going to quite attach the trailer yet. We're going to swing it around and try to use the winch on it for a little bit. There we go. Oh, let's see if we'll hit it. No, it's not available to us yet. Not far enough forward. Alright, maybe we have to swing the back end around a little. Alright, let's see if that'll give it to us. There it is. Come on over. Alright, we got it attached, pseudo attached, where we gotta go. Let's see, uh, well let's go to here and we'll swing it around here and then I'll be trapped again. That should work, or I could just, let's see if I can't go straight to it. It looks like there's a small item in the way. Alright, let's move forward. Well, that doesn't look anything like what it described as what's there. I love how accurate the maps are. Well, I'm not going to be able to drive through that. What about that? Well, it ain't going to happen if it do the truck doesn't turn. Yeah, the, the, no, the wheels were turned, so why didn't the truck turn? Look, it, it's still going, there we go. Now it cranks the wheels around. Alright, now there's a pile of junk there, I won't be able to get around that. Oh, good, I should be able to test the trailer now. Don't sink too much. All right, let's try this again. Oh, it's sunk a lot now. All right, back up onto the high ground. There we go. Going around the back, taking out his fence. I'm not turning with a darn. It's veering. Barely veering at that. All right, try it again. All right, one more to go. One more drop to go. Look at the pumpkin patch. Bye bye fence. Boom. Kick that one out like it was just a plastic barrier. Hoo ha, we are so close. So close, come on. Just cross the line, there we go. We got a completion in with the new 7100 done all right if you like these videos hit that like button and please subscribe hit that like button let me know you want to see more till next time i will see you later